Hello Cancer, how are you? Welcome to my channel, Star 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 and welcome to your reading. So Cancer, this is your reading for the month of August uh, 2021. You can consider this as a mid-month reading. This is a general reading, Cancer. Uh, please take what resonates and leave what doesn't. Energies might be vice versa and time is fluid, okay? Also, Cancer, I would appreciate if you would hit like, share and subscribe and comment down below. If you find yourself getting resonated with this reading, okay? I would also request you to hit that notification bell so that you will be notified whenever I upload the videos. Cancer, there is an extended reading for this one. And if you are interested in the same, if you are excited to know what your person truly thinks and feels about you, what action they will take towards you, what is the likely conclusion between you and your person, you can go ahead and you can check out the link that has been provided in the description box and also in the comment section. Okay. Uh, now coming back to this reading cancer, what I'm going to do is I'm going to place a couple of cards over here and they will represent your energy. Then I'm going to place a couple of cards over here and they will represent the energy of the person you are thinking about, you are dealing with. In between, I'm going to place a couple of cards and they will represent the mutual energy between you and your person. Okay. So let's get started now. So we have is a ten of wands, we have empress and we have is the sun. For your person we have page of cups, we have is six of wands and we have is the death. Then we have is two of cups and we have is seven of wands. So Cancer you may be dealing with a Libra, with a Leo, Scorpio, Aries. Okay so Aries, Leo, Sag, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Okay. And Libra. If the sign pops up all the better, let's not remain fixed on the signs. So you may be seeing a lot of 333-222-1111-777-888. Okay. Right. Ten of Wands, Empress and the Sun. Cancer, you're doing something. You're doing something to cleanse your life. Okay? There are a lot of unnecessary situations in your life. There are a lot of unnecessary people in your life. Okay? And you are just realizing that these unnecessary situations and these unnecessary people need to exit from your life. Okay? Because they are becoming unnecessary burden for you. Okay, you need to clear off that burden off of your chest. You, you basically are thinking that you, you want something new, something better in your life. And the old situations and the old people or energies, uh, not all of them, but few of them are burdensome and they don't deserve a place in your life or they need to go away. So what I see is that you are doing certain things to cleanse your life. So maybe you're cutting off some people from your life. You're cutting out certain situations from your life, right? Uh, not easy. Let me tell you that. Cutting out these people, cutting out these situations is not easy for you. Okay, but you're almost there. You're not giving up you are definitely going to cut them off and cut them out because you know that if you do if you cleanse your life if you cleanse your life cancer this is what you are meant uh, to be you're meant to be an empress you're meant to be an emperor you're meant to rise up but certain people and certain situations are pulling you down not allowing you to rise up okay now these situations and people can be can be regarding romance romantic situations can be uh i'm hearing friendships for some of you there are some uh, disturbed family dynamics uh, dynamic as well okay so whatever is pulling you down or whosoever is pulling you down you are uh, look you made your you took efforts to 
create a, a balanced situation with those people right but somehow you're sensing that nothing is working out and finally you are left with no choice but to remove those people and those situations from your life some of you are changing jobs you are you're quitting a job right so something that is quite burdening something that is not making you happy is going away because you are meant to experience that abundant happiness you are meant to experience that abundant satisfaction you are meant to experience that abundant love loyalty and care from someone and till the time you don't cleanse this you are not going to experience this you know that intuitively you know that and that's why you are you're making some important decisions right i see cancer that for some of you a monetary abundance is coming your way okay especially if you're doing a job change the next job is going to bring you a lot of uh, a big hike in your salary it will be a good designation it will be quite it will be a lot more respected designation and a lot more respected job and a and a very high paying job is what i'm getting uh, it is going to be drastically different from your past one or if it's not about the job i see you will flourish in your business or if for some of you inheritance may also come your way i see some sudden increase okay you're shifting from 10 of wands to empress so there is a sudden rise in your abundance that's what i'm getting cancer a sudden rise so it's very likely that money monetary abundance is increasing suddenly okay that's the energy i'm getting over here so some of you if you are quite frequent in purchasing lottery tickets i would suggest you to continue doing that okay because luck is definitely favoring you guys with the sun card you're feeling more than happy maybe you're enjoying your singlehood you're feeling more than happy uh feeling quite relieved you're feeling there is no burden of uh, relationships right now okay you are also getting relocated somewhere maybe some news is coming your way which is making you extremely excited okay you you are finally feeling that i can be myself now okay there is no one to object me there is no one to stop me from being myself probably you were in a setup or in an environment in the past where there was a lot of restriction where you were being suppressed continuously or for a or for a long period of time you were not allowed to be yourself you were being allowed to play only within a frame of rules okay you can play only within that typical uh you can only play within that typical boundaries is what that was your situation in the past but now you're feeling extremely free you're feeling extremely liberated now you're feeling that you're out of that zone where you were feeling where you were not feeling yourself right so also i'm getting an energy that there is there is something that is happening which is making you extremely happy cancer and this energy can be about a past person coming back or you know you finding you finding your equal match there is a good news that is coming your way cancer and i want you to be ready for that because sometimes it happens that because you are in this 10 of wands energy right now sometimes when this good news comes you are not prepared mentally to receive the blessings what are that are coming your way what happens is when you are not prepared your mindset is different you you delay those blessings or sometimes it also happens that there is a time frame for uh, for those uh, for blessings that are meant to come your way so if you are not open to receive the blessings during that time frame it may happen that the blessings may not even come your way right or it will just get delayed so make sure that you are ready willing and open to receive the blessings that are coming your way because these are some big blessings and i don't want you to miss that opportunity so page of cups and six of wands and the death for your person there is a realization that is happening over here your person is realizing their innermost feelings and 
this realization is not sudden your person had an idea about their feelings for you at the time when you were with them as well okay so it's not something new it is yes but of course it is slow and it is gradual but now the realization is at a different level than it was in the past and your person is becoming sure day by day about their feelings for you every single passing day they are becoming more and more sure about their feelings for you cancer okay and they are so sure now they they are confident that they want you in their life okay they are confident that you are the one for them they are confident that they cannot find anyone better than you this lifetime they are confident that their life is incomplete without you they are confident that even if they move on they will keep on finding you in everyone else their mind is so hooked on to you right now and they are ready to do anything to make the situation work out so i see some transformation that is happening over here for some of you i'll be honest a new person is coming towards you and this new person is looking pretty confident this new person is someone who has already worked on themselves who have been through a lot in their life and they know they this person is someone who i'm i'm specifically talking about the new person this person is someone who values loyalty and integrity and you know this is a person with values they are not a surface level person they are someone who is quite substantial and they have been through a lot but every single time this person has come out of extreme like every single time this person was quite successful in coming out of extremely difficult and challenging situations this person is like a rising phoenix they go to the rock bottom challenges pull them down to the rock bottom but every single time they successfully come out of that situation and they rise up again and again and again okay this person is someone who doesn't fear challenges they don't fear challenges they they're quite uh this person is someone who is very grounded but also very confident about what they want in their life and they know basically how to deal with people this person comes with a lot of wisdom because they have been through some uh difficult situations in their life right this person has transformed again and again and again multiple times this person keeps on transforming like if you see w- w- like if you if you would have seen this person 10 years ago this person would have been a different person like you wouldn't even you wouldn't have even noticed them back then but now they are very different and 10 years going ahead 10 years from now this person will be again someone who is going to be different okay so i see that this person keeps on transforming a lot one reason is that this person is a constant learner they keep on learning a lot of things okay and this person is going to be a not just a lover for you they are going to be everything for you like a lover a friend a partner a philosopher a mentor a guide okay also capricorn love is for sure happening in your life okay but then there is going to be someone who is not going to like that i'm getting an i'm getting an energy cancer i'm sorry did i see some other zodiac sign before i okay i'm getting an energy cancer if i said i'm sorry it, it was just a slip of tongue okay uh i'm getting an energy cancer that most likely a new person is going to enter in your life you are going to accept the new person and the past person is not going to like that you have a lot of love for your past person but you will be more inclined to choose a new person that's what i'm getting okay all right i hope this resonates cancer i uh, hit like share and subscribe and comment down below 
and also uh, if you're interested in the extended link is in the, is in the description box and in the comment section we see what your person truly thinks and feels about you what action they will take towards you what is the likely conclusion between you and your person okay all right bye bye then